Hello, yes. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, madam. What's your name? I'm Loella Rufin. How, can, how could I call your name? Loella. Loella. Very long name. Wella, is it okay? Yes, Wella. How old are you? I'm 28 years old, madam. Single or married? Single, madam. Single mother with how many kids? Only one. How old? She's five years old. Mm. And you are high school graduate? Yes, madam. They have brother and sister? Yes, madam. I have two brothers and one sister. And you are the? Eldest. Would you mind to describe yourself being the eldest child of the family? Well, madam, as my parents are not in, in the Philippines, so I'm trying my best to be there for my siblings, other siblings. Well, if they have problems, I will try my best to let them feel that even though we don't have parents, I'm still here to be there, um, to be with them. So you are you act as a mother for them. Yes, madam. How do you discipline your brothers and sister? Every time they done something or they did mistakes, how did you or how do you discipline them? Well, madam, for me, I will talk to them nicely and I will not um, say bad things. I will just let them know that they did is wrong, and then I will tell them that. They will not do it again. Mm. Do they listen to you as well? Yes, madam. Okay. As long as I will mm, let them understand that it's not right. Mm. So you are trying just to talk to them? Yes, madam. So it means to say uh, you are a very good sister for them? Yes, thank you. You never beat them? No, madam. D did you experience to cook for them? Yes, madam, I do, but it's just uh, some simple Food. foods. Mm. You told me if your mother is not in Philippines, where is your mom? She's in Kuwait. She's working as domestic help yes, as well? Yes, madam. So who will gonna take good care of your five years old girl? My sister and my grandmother. Oh, your sister is elder than you? No. I, I, it means as you are the eldest, sorry. Yes, madam. Mm. So how old is grandma? She is 70 years old. Mm. So they are living with your grandma? Yes, madam. Now, this is your first time to apply in abroad as domestic helper? Yes, madam. So, would you mind to tell me in your own knowledge, what are the duties of domestic helper? Well, for me, well, you need to be good for the, your future employer. employers. Um, you need to understand them to know that um, what's good and bad. You need to listen to them and understand also. And you need to follow what is right for you. How about your duties? Yes, madam. I will try my very best to um, do what I needed to do at, for my work. So what are you, do you expect? Do you expect that you wash clothes? Yes, madam. I, wa I wash clothes. I cook. I clean. I'm flexible, madam. As I, I tried all the work at my grandmother's house, I always help. Mm -mm. I clean. I cook. I wash the dishes. Wash, wash the clothes. By hands or by washing machine? By hands, madam. By hands. Mm -mm. So... In working in abroad, you, do you know what does it mean by homesick? Yes, madam, I really do. Can you describe what is homesick is or I've, define homesick? Well, I, I will miss my family and then especially my daughter. Even though I'm in here just in Manila, madam, I always cry at night. Okay, so in the future, if you go in abroad and if you miss her, what will you do? Well, for me, um, even though I miss her, I really do my work. It's because it's for her future. Mm. So what will you do to yourself for you to be comforted if you miss her? Well, if I have a chance, I will talk to her in the phone. But in, the ho in Hong Kong, you could not use your mobile phone during the job hour, only during after you've done your work or in your day off. Oh, yes, madam. So what will you do? I'll just pray always, madam. Mm-hmm. 
for them to be safe always and good health uh -huh. and then I will be the ju just do my be my work you make yourself busy yes madam uh -huh. so what is your wish well I wish to work in Hong Kong it's why being a single mom is not very easy madam uh -huh. and I don't I don't like to be um, always relying relying for my parents mm. I want um, I want to experience that I I will do the hard work and mm. pay for the edu my financial edu uh, financial in schools of my daughter mm. so what are you doing now in Philippines well I'm selling bargain clothes madam in your house yes madam and sometimes i do online too mm -mm, cloth clothing yes madam so that is where you get your everyday needs yes madam mm. in working in a, what do you expect okay what is your expectation for your future employer in hong kong well i expect that we understand each other and you will be good to me too as i will good and i'll try my very best for the kids and for you, for my future employer. employer. Challenge question. If you are outside and you are with the kid and you are crossing down the street and suddenly your phone ring, keep on ringing, and, but you are with the kid. So what will you do? Well, mom, I will just go to the street and then when we're at the safe place safe place already then i will answer my phone it's because it's dangerous to answer in the street mm. and then i have the kids also mm. means to say you will not answer the call if you yes, are crossing madam. the road yes madam when will you cross the road during red or or green green madam green how about if the if the orange is blinking, is blinking already, okay, it was green, and then blinking, blinking, will you still cross the road? No, madam. Mm, good. Very good. Last question. If the baby got sick or got fever, and your employer is not around, what will you do? Or how will you manage that kind of scenario? Well, um, I will get a towel and then I put a warm water and wipe the body of the baby and put the towel in the forehead too. Mm -mm. It's because it will make her body okay. Mm -hmm. How about if the fever is getting high? I will bring her to the hospital really? and tell the, my employee to because it's very dangerous good okay good common sense you like polish yes madam but in hong kong you should not use okay, the polish madam. okay oh, yes madam you cannot use because if especially if you're cooking then we don't allow you to use yes, the nail madam. polish it's okay it's a fashion yeah i understand we are ladies okay do you like reading books yes i do madam how about singing Sometimes. Can you sing a song for me for Kit? Um, Anything. For my daughter, I sing a song, but it's a Tagalog song. It's okay, go ahead. <laughs> I want to listen. Well, she likes the song Ikaw by Yang Constantino. And then. Um, Can you give me the chorus? Ikaw, ang pagibig na hinintay. Puso ay nalumbay ng kahit agal. No, nandito na. Oh, it's okay. I forgot the lyrics. It's okay. I don't care whatever you sing. For me, it's how you obey my command. Yes, ma'am. That's my very point. Okay? Yes, On madam. how you obey me. Yes, madam. In Hong Kong, people there are so demanding. One last question. Okay, madam. We have the bedroom, living room, toilet, and the kitchen. Which part must be the cleanest one? 
kitchen, madam. Why? It's because we cook there, and then we we eat too, and the food is in there. Okay, second is? Toilet. Very great. Good. Good common sense. Describe your personality. Well, I'm flexible, madam. I always like to smile too. And You're so cute. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you, madam. What else? Well, I like talking too. Mm. And this is good for the kids. Yes, madam. And I'm. I always follow what is good for me. And I'm honest too. Mm, good. Yes, Listen, if you go to Hong Kong, you must always ask employer before you commit mistake. If you are doubt for something, you better ask them, okay? Okay, madam. And don't answer yes, yes, if you really don't understand the instruction of your okay, madam. madam. In Hong Kong, you cannot use your mobile phone during the job hour. Okay, madam. Okay, and day off is chosen by the employer. Okay, are you willing if they will buy your day off? Oh, I'm very willing, madam. Good, good, good. Tell me a nice message, although this is your first time. Um, to my future employer, although this is my first time, I will do my very best for your kids. I will love them as like mine. I will take care of them. And I know at the age of um, kids, Nowadays, they are hard-headed, yeah. they're naughty, but um, mm -hmm. as long as you talk to them nicely and you let them understand that it's right and wrong, it's all good. And then to my employer, I will do my best and respect each other and I will follow all the works that you mm -hmm. will give me. Okay. Do you love looking after kids? Yes, I do, madam. How about baby? Uh, I do. I do, madam. You are willing? Yes, madam. I'm very much willing. Who was the one who took care of your kid when baby? I am, madam. You are breastfeeding before? Yes, I do, madam. Okay. Thank you and see you in Hong Kong. Thank Say you bye. Too, bye.